morning, friends. Greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I use nutritional supplements in my practice where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body. You are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we are here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, acne, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds. Recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure. Because the human biological system is a healing system, it's a regenerating system and designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment -moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing, renewing, regenerating system a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, we welcome your phone calls on the bright side. We want to hear from you. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you read something, heard something, if you're interested in in the longevity products or you have questions about the formulations or ingredients or skincare or skincare ingredients we want to hear from you 844-236-6010 is our number today and every day on the bright side likewise if you have a success story or if you just want to contribute to the conversation 844-236-6010 is our number if you want to purchase any of the longevity products you hear advertised on the program or recommended on the program please head over to my website's brightsideben.com, brightsideben.com. You can also check out our blogs, pharmacistben.com or criticalhealthnews.com, which we update regularly with news stories as well as blog posts. Thank you to Jonty Collier as well as Robert Lundgren for setting those up. And by the way, we're doing videos now on criticalhealthnews.com. Did a couple on macular degeneration, which seems to be somewhat of a somewhat of a health fad or epidemic for some reason. I get all kinds of letters on macular degeneration. So we posted a couple of videos on remedies or nutritional strategies. I should say, I hate that word remedies, but nutritional strategies for dealing with macular degeneration, preventing macular degeneration. We're going to cover Alzheimer's disease this weekend, and that'll be posted up as well. If you want to sign up for the newsletter and sign up to be notified when we do the videos, head over to criticalhealthnews.com. Of course, you can also order products right off the website, or you can sign up to join the Brightside Ben team right off the websites, brightsideben.com, criticalhealthnews.com, or pharmacistben.com, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. If you're interested in purchasing any of our enzyme products or the Bergamax or our Evolve Energy Weight Loss sublingual spray, you can go to Brightside Health, brightsidehealthproducts.com, and if you want to purchase any of our Truth Treatment Products, that's truthtreatments.com. If you're in the Denver area, I want to see you at the Highlands Ranch Library today, Friday, 1 p.m., Highlands Ranch Library, 9292 Ridgeline Boulevard. I'll be doing a talk for my friend Leslie. And uh, the zip is 80129. If you want to map quest it, please call Leslie at 720-235-9223, 720-235-9223, or you can RSVP at benfuchs.eventbrite.com. That's today, 1 p.m. at the... Highlands Ranch Library, Highlands Ranch, Colorado, 80129. All right, thanks for joining us on The Bright Side. There's an interesting relationship between the sun and aldosterone and vitamin D. We've been talking about aldosterone now for a couple of days. Aldosterone is the little-known stress hormone that's associated with high blood pressure, associated with salt depletion, electrolyte depletion, and it's associated with stress. And nobody ever talks about aldosterone. If you're taking an ACE inhibitor drug, a Zestril or Lozar or, or a Cozar or Los, Losartan or Prinavil or uh, Vasotac, there's a, there's a few of these things. You're dealing with aldosterone. These ACE inhibitor drugs work by suppressing aldosterone. Vitamin D is a type of aldosterone. Actually, vitamin D and aldosterone are types of cholesterol. Did you know that? Vitamin D is actually cholesterol. Aldosterone is actually cholesterol. Oh, it's a little tweaked version of cholesterol. Cholesterol is kind of like a chassis. And then by accessorizing this chassis with different pieces, you get different hormones. 
So in this way, estrogen is a type of cholesterol. Testosterone is a type of cholesterol. Vitamin D is a type of cholesterol. Aldosterone, a type of cholesterol. Pregnenolone, a type of cholesterol. All your steroid hormones are types of cholesterol. We say, in the world of nutrition, we say, well, cholesterol is a raw material for these steroid hormones, but that doesn't really get due justice to the relationship between cholesterol and these various hormones. If we really understood that all of the fun hormones, estrogen and progesterone and testosterone, when I say fun, I mean health and wellness and vibrancy and robustness and building and strength and vigor and intelligence and creativity hormones are really types of cholesterol, we would think twice about using a statin drug. We would think twice about paying any attention to a boneheaded medical professional that told you to take a statin drug. These are all, all these steroid hormones that help us deal with life, deal with stress and help us build and help us repair. They're all types of cholesterol. Tell that to the next doctor who tells you to lower your cholesterol. You might as well tell you to lower your, stress, your steroid hormones, to lower your fertility hormones, to lower your growth hormones, to lower your immune hormones. And by the way, the sun can also be helpful. More boneheaded medical advice. The sun activates cholesterol. That's what vitamin D is. It's an activated version of cholesterol. Without the sun, you can't activate your cholesterol and it can't be turned into vitamin D. If your doctor or your skincare professional, and that includes estheticians, unfortunately, who oftentimes listen to doctors, if any healthcare professional ever tells you to, to stay out of the sun, if they ever recommend sun avoidance, I would recommend that you get a different doctor. I would recommend that your doctor start studying some chemistry. I would recommend that your doctor doesn't make any recommendations if he tells you to stay out of the sun or he tells you to take a statin drug or he beats up on this amazing, marvelous, stupendously important molecule, cholesterol. Cholesterol is the distinguishing biochemical that makes us not plants. A plant does not make cholesterol because plants don't move and plants don't think, at least not in the same way we do. Moving and thinking and action and being a human being, being an, uh, an animal, being part of the animal kingdom requires cholesterol. Cholesterol is humanity's best biomole biomolecular friend. And then the vitamin D that's produced from the cholesterol is perhaps the most important of all the vitamins, at least when it comes to wellness and building and health. And by the way, it's not even a vitamin. It's a steroid hormone, even though we call it a vitamin. If you're out in the sun and you're slathering on a sunscreen because your medical professional told you to, you're not only going to be screening out the sun, but you're also going to be making less vitamin D, a lot less vitamin D. According to a 2008 article in the journal for nurse practitioners, sunscreen application reduces vitamin D synthesis by over 90%. If you're using an SPF 8, according to this article, SPF 8, Vitamin D production drops by 92.5%. And if you're really heliophobic, if you're really scared of the sun, if you're really bought into the boneheaded medical model, and you're using an SPF 15, vitamin D synthesis drops by a whopping 99%, essentially shutting it down completely. Now, food and supplemental vitamin D is always going to be inferior to the sunshine vitamin D. But sometimes you might need supplemental vitamin D. Sometimes you might need to make sure you're getting vitamin D from food. Vitamin D is found in animal products only, although mushrooms will make some vitamin D. Mushrooms are kind of a cross between animals and bacteria. The fungal kingdom is like partially bacterial and partially, partially animal, or, or partially plant, I should say, and partially animal. It's kind of a, occupies an in-between position between the plant kingdom and the animal kingdom. And it turns out that mushrooms can make a, make a little bit of vitamin D, too. So make sure you're eating your mushrooms if you want food, vitamin D. Make sure you're getting dairy and eggs, animal foods, organ, organ meats, fish, fish oil, fish liver. These are good sources of food, vitamin D. And, and while the sun is the superior form, or sunshine-driven vitamin D is a superior form of vitamin D, there are times when you do need to supplement with vitamin D or get food-based vitamin D. Hang tight. I'll tell you what I mean when we come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. 844-236-6010 is our number. We'll be back right after this. All right, we're back on 
on the bright side. Got lines open for you at 844-236-6010. We'll get your calls here momentarily. If you want to purchase any of the longevity products you hear advertised or recommended on the program, you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. Make sure you ask about the Beyond Tangy Tangerine liquid minerals, liquid nutrition, powder nutrition that you add to water and drink. Liquids are always the, the best way to get your nutrition short of IV. The Beyond Tangy Tangerine powder you add to liquid, drink it down, the OsteoFX and the... And the uh, Essential fatty acids, the ultimate EFAs, all make the make up the healthy start pack from longevity. Great way to get your mighty 90. And if you want to start a longevity business, it's a great way to make some money, helping helping spread the word about the power and importance of a good nutritional supplement program. Call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. They can tell you all about it. If you're in the Denver area, love to see you today at the Highlands Ranch Library. I'll be doing a talk. The body is a healing system. Your body is a healing system, as you know good and well. If you've listened to this program, the body heals itself. We'll be talking about all the various strategies for health and wellness, easy strategies, including nutritional supplementation. That's at the Highlands Ranch Library today, Friday, 1 p.m., 9292 Ridgeline Boulevard, Highlands Ranch, Colorado, 80129. Call 720-235-9223 to RSVP or go to benfukes.eventbrite.com to RSVP as well. All right, so we're talking vitamin D. Sunshine vitamin D is the superior form of vitamin D. Let's be clear about this. I know I hear this from dermatologists, friends of mine who are dermatologists and doctors, and they'll say, well, you can get your vitamin D from food and from supplements. It's not the same thing. Vitamin D from the sun is a superior form of vitamin D. In addition, vitamin D from the sun is, has a, a, a control mechanism so you don't overdose. Your body will stop making vitamin D when you have enough. We're designed to get vitamin D from the sun. The sun hits cholesterol in the skin and transforms the cholesterol into activated cholesterol, if you will, and that's what we call vitamin D. Now, while food and supplemental vitamin D are going to be inferior to sunshine, there are times when you need it, particularly if you're dark-skinned, African-American or Hispanic. According to the article we quoted earlier from the Journal of Nurse Practitioners, people with darker skin pigmentation have a dramatic reduction in vitamin D synthesis, up to 99%. That's a lot. It's like wearing an SPF 15 all the time. Now, it's a good thing because you're not going to burn, but it's not a good thing because you're not going to make vitamin D. If you're African American, and by the way, African Americans have dramatically higher rates of vitamin D deficiency issues like prostate disease, as we talked about yesterday, like hypertension, as we talked about yesterday, like blood sugar problems. All of these are at least partially functions of vitamin D deficiency. Even cancer can be a function of vitamin D deficiency, at least partially. Same with older folks. For older folks, they don't have as much cholesterol in their skin. So they're not going to be able to make as much vitamin D. That's why older folks should be supplementing with vitamin D or vitamin D-containing fish oil, as you'll find in the ultimate EFAs from longevity. Cholesterol is unbelievably important for, well, for the whole body, but especially for the skin. This is so underappreciated. Skin cells require cholesterol to grow correctly. Statin drugs are associated with a skin condition called ichthyosis, fish skin, super dry, flaky skin. Why? Because by suppressing cholesterol production, you suppress moisture factors in the skin. Cholesterol is a raw material for moisture factors in the skin. It's also a requirement for making cells, so cholesterol is very important for healing. I put in my true serum, a lot of it. I put in our omega-6 healing cream as well. Go to truthtreatments.com, truthtreatments.com. I'm telling you, if you haven't tried our omega-6 healing cream and you have some kind of burn or sunburn or skin rash, you are truly missing, in my opinion, the most powerful product you'll ever use on the skin as far as healing goes. It's also a great moisturizer too, made with cholesterol and vitamin C, also essential fats. And by the way, essential fats, omega-6 fats, are also important for skin healing. Cholesterol is just unspeakably important for the entire body and for the skin. In fact, a good case could be made that cholesterol is the most important component of the skin. Certainly, it's the most multifunctional component in the skin. Cholesterol is like a magical substance that's transformed by the, act by the activity of ultraviolet radiation into a supercharged molecule. In addition to being types of cholesterol, cholesterol 